The number of food trucks in Traverse City has grown in the last couple years and most recently has had a big impact on the east side of Front Street. That end of East Front, which is, which was, which is the 400 and 500 block of East Front, was a fairly quiet commercial area and just the addition of Little Fleet has added a lot of pedestrian traffic. Uh, particularly in the evening. Now the food trucks are hoping to increase that business by extending hours of operation in the evening and early morning. Uh, here at the Little Fleet, you know, the bars open until midnight most nights, sometimes a little later, and to have food available throughout that whole period is kind of the goal. Um, and then I think that once the bars close, it's it's not only good business practice, but probably good for everybody if there's something out there for people to eat. If approved, business hours for the food trucks on private property would run from 6 a.m. to 3 a.m. And while some businesses don't mind. But the one thing I keep hearing is, um, you know, private property is okay, but public property, some of the restaurants are concerned about opening up more, uh, you know, food truck availability um, on public property. Others say they do. Owners at the Wellington Inn Bed and Breakfast say that customers at the Little Fleet take up parking for their own guests. They also said in an email to the city clerk that the current hours already create enough noise and trash in their neighborhood and that keeping them open later is asking too much. Considering that this is the C4 district and it's the downtown area of Traverse City, you know, there's people out late at night regardless of whether food trucks are open or not.